Hey guys, it is 60 degrees and 2.16 p.m. The sun is out. What the hell is this? I don't know, but whatever it is, I like it. And uh, I'm just coming home now. I'm, uh, I'm gonna run inside and put some stuff away. And then I think we're going on a bike ride. 60 degrees is beautiful. It's a little windy and the wind's a little cool, so that isn't good. Third. Um, but I'll probably just wear a light jacket and the sun feels great and it's barely cloudy at all. There's a couple little little hazy, wispy, cirrus clouds up there, so not too bad. First time getting the bike out, the last day of January 2012, that's going to be really cool. The roads are pretty salty, but they're very dry from the sun beating down on it all day, so that is good. And uh, I'll talk to you when I go downstairs to pull the bike out. My god, it's it's not going to run real well. It's going to real well. It's going to need air in the tires, air horn, I may need to oil some stuff. But we'll see. Last time Ken and I went out together was Halloween last year. <laughs> Aside from being windy as hell, it's actually pretty nice out here. It's about 62 degrees. Ken's doing the first show of the year, which is going to be this, guess what, BMW X5 M Sport Package. So I might as well walk over here and document. Got ourselves a D3. Looks like a E91 or 2 or 3 or whatever the hell they call it. X Drive. This is the X5 M Sport. Pretty nice. It's a good first car of the year. What was the first car last year? Was that the Penna or the, the Cayenne? G550. Uh, the G550 Mercedes. The year before that was a Porsche Cayenne. And uh, this is obviously significantly better than both. All right. So it is. Uh, what time is it? About 3:15. And there are 3:30. There's two police cars over here. One in front of that three series with the Outback back and then behind it. And they just brought a guy out of Luchitas, which is a Mexican restaurant with a bar. They just brought him out in cuffs and put him in the back of the police car. So mid-afternoon, he's having a bad day, or the wife isn't doing something right, or maybe he isn't doing something right, forget my drift. So he's in the bar and probably just got charged with disorderly conduct. The NAACP has set up shop. Look at this bunch of shit. This was here last year. Hi. I think it's here every year. It is. Um, I guess they plow it off the end of the entire parking garage, <laughs> right here. Uh, and then we've got drainage problems down here all summer. But it just looks terrible. I, why is it so black though? I guess it's just crap from the yeah, parking lot and oil. And 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 salt and oil. It is really thoroughly disgusting. When Taylor gets here in 10 minutes, I will give him $50 if he climbs that. Uh, yeah. Hey buddy. Good, how you doing? Welcome, welcome, the first ride of the year. You're a little late, because you had to drive your brother home, but I guess you didn't have a choice. You had to pump your tires up? Yep. Okay, all right, do your curtsy. Do your curtsy, you're in a perfect curtsy position. Do you know how to do a curtsy? Not right All right, we got uh, Cannon, he's gonna try out the Jesco Mobile. Go. See how this goes. Well, the gears don't work well. It's a little small for both of us. That had some good pickup there, right? Yeah, for a mountain bike. Yeah, for a mountain bike, but right around town. Brick check. Oh, not bad. Not bad. Decent it suspension. Didn't work the first time. No, it didn't work the first time. Well, one out of two. Like this time. Yeah. Don't brake too hard. Yeah, don't skid. No, we know the main reason behind that one. Oh yeah. E38 740 with a small version of my wheels. Mine are 18s, those look like about 16s. Are those even OEM BMW wheels? I don't think it looks like it's on custom. Those, they've gotta be custom. If they were clean and if that car were clean, they would look pretty good on that. That's weird. Oh, friggin' rights, the Ohio Turnpike's done. I filmed this last year. It used to be two lanes in each direction. And uh, now they've got it down to three lanes, or up to three lanes. All right, so Kenan's gonna hold the camera here, and I'm gonna go get the M5, and we're gonna do a flyby at about 160 miles an hour, so uh, we'll be right back. All right, gang, today may have ruined me. Today could be that pivotal point that I just get done with winter, and psychologically, I am ready for spring. It's about 64 degrees. We got Kenan's sisters out walking dogs. Um, everything looks like shit because it's still dead and dormant and brown and dead. But it was really good to get out. I feel it in my legs, and it's crazy. But when I get in night, when I get in bed at night, they hurt so much. And when I get up, they feel great. So I, it feels good to get out. And we did 8.7 miles today. 
Uh, we usually do 10, so I guess we didn't ride around downtown as much, but nevertheless it was phenomenal to get out and, and get downtown. January 31st, that's the earliest we've done the full downtown run. And really there's no snow to speak of, so that's great. It totally feels like spring, having the sun out, coming home, it smells like strawberries in here. Uh, there's tons of people out on bikes and walking dogs, so it's crazy. Maybe spring is going to come early this year, which would be very, very welcome. There's more neighbors getting, getting pulled by a dog. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. There goes the dog. I see something. Some bitch. Man, that thing totally just whipped that lady like 30 feet. Maybe we can see out my office window. Oh, I got this, this uh, white pine in the way. I think it's a white pine. It is just done. Ah, uh, the BMW is too sweet. All right, it's 6 o'clock or a few of, and uh, I, I've noticed that these lights that come on the house, I, I reset the timer that trips them on and off when I took down the Christmas stuff, because I just pulled the timer out so they didn't come on and all the Christmas crap was on. Uh, now they're coming on at what was, you know, good and dark in January when I took the Christmas stuff down. Well, really, it's been three weeks since I took Christmas stuff down. It feels like about two months. Um, in some respects. In some respects it feels like three days. Time is moving so quickly. Um, but they've been on now for maybe 20 minutes or a half hour and if I were setting them now I still wouldn't even have them on yet. So that's a good sign that it's getting lighter earlier in the morning and staying lighter later in the day. Uh, so we're gaining about three minutes of daylight a day. You probably can't even see me at all right now because of the crap uh, pickup of the light on the flip. But I'm out here in the sunroom now with my limonade. And I've got neighbors out wheeling the uh, kids around. I got dogs out there. And uh, it's pretty nice. But today was an awesome day. We're back into the high 40s and rain tomorrow. And then we've got like 10 days back in the 30s. But I guess that's what we can expect for this time of year. My point is spring is on its way pretty quickly. And uh, that is great news. Here's what it looked like one year ago today. This is Kenan's vlog from uh, actually February 1st. So a day from tomorrow. I guess this the direct What a difference. All right guys, uh, it's about nine, is it eight, eight, 15 ish. Yeah. There's been a huge limb in this tree here at Kenan's house. We're in his driveway. I know you can't see much, but we are in his driveway. And this has been, there's been this branch up here for how many years? Since I was in first grade. Since Kenan was in first grade. You're now in 11th grade, 10 years. Up here, Definitely. above where people park, and it's just been there. So, we have got some hardware here. We originally tried jousting with this rope. <laughs> jousting. Well, we had spears, and we chucked them up there with rope over it to try to pull it down, and those were all negative attempts. So now we've got what I think is... Um, I, I don't know what it is. It's got a really long handle on it, and uh, we'll let you know which one of us loses an eye first. Right there, I can't get it. Oh, we've almost got it. We've changed its position about 90 degrees. Oh, whoa, whoa, there it goes. Oh, congratulations. Uh, Ten years in the making. Yeah. Well, it's, it's it's not that big, but it, now it's gone. All right, we're trying this again. Ice pick versus um, wine bottle. Technically. It is very strong. Now you could use that. Yeah. 